how do sheep contribute to global warming? They're ruminants. When they're chewing the cud, they belch out methane, which is a powerful, potent greenhouse gas. When they eat the grass, it goes into the rumen, which is the first of the four stomachs that they have. It's a right. big vat of soupy slop okay. full of microorganisms which break down some of the grass. Um, and then, as you'll see them lying in the field and they, they belch up, and as they belch up, they bring a, a lump of the stuff from the rumen up with them and then chew it again. Right. Um, and it's when they bring that lump of food up, that's, that's when really the methane... Really... In fact, in their entirety, British sheep are belching out methane equivalent to about five million tonnes of carbon dioxide every year. But is it possible to reduce that contribution from our sheep flocks? Well, that's what this experiment is designed to try and figure out. It's a very unusual kind of sheep pen built into a trailer imported over from New Zealand where they've done quite a bit of this work. And each of these is an airtight chamber into which an individual sheep has been put. Now, if you think it's quite stressful for the animal, I can tell you they're looking quite relaxed in here. And what's happening is they've been popped in this chamber, they're spending 50 minutes in here, and the researchers are measuring the amount of methane that each sheep belches out in that time. And the whole purpose is to try and identify the sheep in this flock which are the lower emitters of methane and then to take those individuals, understand their genetics and which genetic factors are possibly linked to that lower methane emission, and then breed from them to establish a low carbon flock for the future. 